creep is a very slow flow or shifting of material causing permanent shape change at stress levels below the yield point in all metal alloys and elevated temperatures the temperature at which the creep begins and the rate at which it progresses are generally indicated by the melting point of the alloy the higher the melting point the higher the threshold temperature and the slower the rate the deformation at higher temperatures progresses through three distinct phases primary secondary and tertiary the three phases are shown schematically in figure one low temperature and high temperature creep strain which plots low temperature and high temperature creep strain of a material on loading versus time at constant engineering stress and temperature the curves are schematic with the high temperature curve depicting all three stages the actual shape is determined by material alloy variations stress level and temperature primary and secondary creep are generally considered in design total creep decreases rapidly with reduced stress levels in one alloy a fifty percent reduction in stress reduces creep deformation by ninety percent the low temperature curve describes aluminum and magnesium alloys at room temperature at higher temperatures primary creep which is the shortest phase in terms of time begins at a relatively fast diminishing rate the point at which the rate becomes constant is considered the end of the primary and the beginning of the secondary phase secondary creep the longest phase progresses at a constant rate there is no loss of strength during the primary and secondary phases the tertiary phase begins when the rate begins to increase its progress is comparatively rapid and the rate continues to increase the material loses strength during this phase until it permanently changes shape and failure occurs